It's the thing that's so different about this sport versus any other sport in Division One athletics is you just you play, you know, you play a game and then you have to turn around and, and 40 minutes later you're starting the next game and we played really poorly the first game. Uh, we we try to address some things because this usually happens the front end of spring break. To be honest with you, it's it's a trend. You know, these kids got so much stuff going on and then okay, it's spring break and I think mentally lose a little bit of focus and it's not just 2012, it's happened just about every year that we've been here for the 20 years we've been here. So uh, really proud of the effort the second game though. I thought Rothland was outstanding. I thought we played great defense up until the last inning. Um, Shane Brown, Shive, Ross was good behind the plate. Um, you know, and we were a lot better offensively. So still a work in progress. Um, Wagner plays hard. So we got uh, got one more. We got to try to get tomorrow. It's hard to uh, come out and win both games, no matter if you're playing, you know, the Yankees or Little League, you know. Um, but you know, we always try to play every game, one game at a time, and um, came out a little rusty. Start game one, but game two, you know, we came out banging. You know, I've always been told if you're in center field, go get whatever you can get. So I mean, I've had a couple of run-ins with the fence. It's not my favorite thing, but. Uh, I'm going to go through it if I have to, you know. I'm going to catch anything I can. You know, we try to recruit a lot of center fielders. We try to recruit a lot of shortstops because those are usually the best athletes and the best players on the field and as well as pitching and catching. But uh, uh, he played center field, you know, in high school, so it hadn't been a big transition for him. Played some in the summer. This past summer played a lot in the fall. And we've got some young guys who are going to be good players as time goes on, but he's the best guy we got right now. So. Again, a guy that, that's uh, really developed over his time here, fifth-year senior, and a uh, pretty darn good player most of the time. Well, Chad definitely started it off. Uh, threw strikes, got ahead early, let defense work. Uh, Corbin had a couple good swings, hit the ball hard, uh, stretched singles to doubles, stuff like that. That's what Coach Hibbs preaches, and that's what we tried to do second game.